there is something that uh, we found in the records, uh, Mr. Chairman, in connection with uh, all of this uh, request for prior approval of the SOJ. Uh, <clears throat> there was this uh, letter coming from the Bucor sometime in 2018 requesting that uh, the authority to release um, uh, PDLs on account of expired sentences be delegated to the Bucor Court Chief. I was unaware of this letter until fairly recently. Who signed that request, sir? I think it was signed by... Uh, I, d I don't have this letter with me, uh, uh, Mr. Chair, but uh, somebody definitely, a uh, higher authority from the Bureau of Corrections requesting that it be delegated, that, that, that power, that authority. But there was no action taken by the Department of Justice in connection with that request. So there was a letter request delegating everything that you mentioned in 953 to the view court uh, director. Is that correct? According to uh, the draft memorandum addressed to me, this was only a draft, but it made mention of a memorandum dated June 4, 2018 from USEC Ronald De La Rosa, Director General, Bureau of Corrections, requesting for the grant of authority for the Director General to approve or act upon the following requests enumerated in Department Order 953. So, nakalista, but uh, the first and foremost is the release of PDLs with expired sentences. No action was taken by the Department on this. Can we get a copy of that, sir? The letter itself uh, will uh, try to secure a copy. Yes, because sir. it's not with me. I'm uh, uh, reading the draft memorandum addressed to me in response to uh, that letter. But the letter itself is not with me right now.